Hey, it's me, Emily Rose, and I am going to be answering these fan questions from around the world here in my home in Southern California. From Dornish Gal 22 h will we ever find out about Nathan and Audrey's matching rings? It looks like the writers have forgotten about him. Well, it looks like. It looks like. But have they? That's always the question, right? Nathan and Audrey's matching rings. There's so much behind that. You know what? Here's the deal. We might find out about their matching rings. We might not find out about them this season. That's a reason for more seasons to come back. Here we go. From the UK, Twitter. Is Audrey pre... Is Audrey... Is Audrey pregnant? Am I... Is Audrey pregnant? Uh... I don't... I don't... I'm not sure. Not saying she couldn't get pregnant. Let's be honest. Come on. All right. Let's see. Carlos J L ninety five. Carlos J L ninety five. J no J L ninety five. Twitter. Do you know the real origin of our Audrey, or are you always confused as we are? I'll answer that um, in faces. Okay. Next one, here we go. From Emily Rose, Spain. Twitter, oh my gosh. I'm in Spain, I have a Spain. Emily Rose, Spain, at Emily Rose, Spain. What do you think about Spain and your Spanish friends? Spanish friends. First of all, I love Spain. Great food, it was awesome. The hotel we stayed at was amazing. I love Spain. And the fact that I have Spanish fans this is pretty awesome. I love to come back to Spain and meet my Spanish friends. That's what I would like to do. Emily Rose for Twitter. O'Reilly or O'Reilly from Twitter. What do you think of the Lexi character? I have to say I like her a lot. I do like her. I was a little concerned though that when we met Lexi that we would still miss Audrey and it seems as though we do miss Audrey. I miss Audrey. Everybody's searching for Audrey. I definitely miss her. I do miss her. I like Lexi and how in your face she can be. I love that. Elise from Twitter. Can I describe season four in one word? Epic. Wowzer hole. Scanning down here, Netherlands at 10 Willicky. Which trouble do you find to be the scariest? Okay, there's a trouble that I would say Lexi comes across and she may really like to live in this place. She may really like to be there, but then we find out, does she really? And I think you'll see it coming up in the season, that's all I can really say. But I think she struggles with whether or not she wants to be there or not. I think you'll know the episode when you see it, and that's a really scary place for her to be. The unknown. If the better could be best, or is it really the worst? Hmm. Okay, next one. Brazil, Emily Rose. Uh, question for you. That would be me. From Leonardo de Mio from Facebook. What was your reaction when you received the invitation to play Audrey Parker? I opened up my mailbox and, no, I'm just kidding. I, when they said that I got the part, I was super excited, but you know what? It's interesting, down deep, I knew that this was a character I really resonated with. And so I was very, I fought for this part. I almost didn't get it. And when I felt like I wasn't gonna get it, I called up my agents and I said, you got to get me in there to read for that part again because I know it's one that I can play. I know it's one that is me. I know it's me. And sure enough, they let me come back and do it again and I got the part. So fight for the things that you know are yours. Who will win your heart, Nathan or Duke? Mm, I can't answer that question. I can't answer that question. Why do you people always ask me that question, Leonardo? Don't ask me that question. Elaine at Trekker867. Do you think the Teague brothers, maybe Vince, will be villains in season four? 
maybe. And on that note, I think that finishes us off. Thank you for a fun-filled uh, strange afternoon in my kitchen, answering all these awesome Haven questions. I hope that you've enjoyed our time, and more importantly, I hope that you tune in to Sci-Fi UK and watch the premiere, the beginnings, and the rest of the season of Haven Season 4, because we got some big things going on, people. Big things. Love ya. Bye. Wowzer hole.